It was a tournament that we've been waiting years for. The Lionesses were going to be going across the country. The tournament was literally a, a fairy tale. It's time for a new journey. This is going to be something special. In December 1921, the FA banned women's football. If we want to do well, we've got to change things. We were trying to push women's football forward. My first club was actually football boys. I was the only girl. At the end of a game, a boy would be crying and the parents would be saying, I can't believe you can let a girl beat you. We was the last community on the list of when the council's going through all the budget lists. The access to football was very limited. I had speed, I had pace, I had hunger, I had desire. I was a young girl who wasn't afraid of diving around in the mud, I wasn't afraid of the ball. I wouldn't be in the position I am, I don't think, if my parents didn't drive me up and down the country playing football. This team is the culmination of many women overcoming adversity. Everyone's really ready, we just want to go. We'd look each other in the eye. The noise was just incredible. All of us knew it was going to be a very tough game. It's difficult to switch off from the pressure. You could see that some people were a bit tense. Everybody in the press room was saying, this isn't going the way that we thought it was going to. We play football because of fans. There's no other purpose to the game. Jill taught me this. She said, there's always time to have a big moment. You have to be ready. just let out this roar of emotion. It felt like a life's work. Our job was to inspire the next generation, and I felt like that was done. Time to let the young guns go on and do what they need to do. I never thought that I was going to be a European champion. I never thought I'd even be a professional footballer. When you get them successes, speak about them proudly. We are finally at that point where we belong. Everything that we did was, I hope, enough to show how much we wanted to do it for everybody that had come before us.